Hello everyone, my name is Titus Win H. Tapia and welcome to my table appointments. Before we begin, I want to say Merry Christmas to you all and Happy New Year. So let's begin with the five utensils here, which I have. And the left side of this is can be called a salad fork. And these are the ones that can pick up the salads and any desserts then. And this next one can be also called a dinner fork, your typical fork that you pick up to use things like steak or whatever. Before this one, you're gonna go to this one. This next utensil is called a steak knife or a dinner knife. You can use this as spreader and this is also to cut things or the food you want it to get. And this one is this teaspoon. This is optional. And these are the ones that you can uh, use for this one. And uh, yeah, that's it. And, yeah, and this next one can be optional also. This could be a dinner spoon or the soup spoon. It could be either two. And I wanted to say this is a soup spoon because this is small and this is a uh, very small. The the scope of this is really deep, so I call this a soup spoon. And now we're gonna go to the napkin. This is your typical napkin you can also find in the restaurants and the bodegas, you know. And what's fascinating in this one is it could be either this side or this side. It could be optional to others. And this one I forgot to mention is the dinner plate or the place plate because this is the main course of the menu. And this is where the, all the food starts. And this one right here is the bread. Okay, I'm going to start with this one, the bread knife or the butter knife. This was spreading all the breads you wanted to go. And this one right here is the bread plate. So this could be optional, you, but this is only on one place, this one. All right, you don't want this to be here or here or here. All right, this is the only place you could go with this. So. This one right here is the salad spoon or the cake spoon. And this one is also optional. It's just the same as this one. But this is for the desserts. And this one right here is the cake fork. Also as the same as this one. But this one is to pick up the desserts. Like this menu right here is the dessert aisle. So. And this one right here is the water goblet. You can also use the normal uh, cup that you always uh, that you always use. And this goblet is different than others because this is a diamond goblet. It's really cool, isn't it? And yeah. And this one right here, I could be mistaken, but this is any wine that you can use, red or white. So this, I think this is a red wine for me. So I couldn't really find a wine that is good, so this is what I used. And this one, eh, I don't know. This is also a wine, they say, but I don't know where to start on the wine because I don't have the others. This could be two wines or the other, alright? And don't forget this one. Hang on. Yeah, there you go. This is called the cup and saucer. You got the cup. Wait, this is the cup, and this is the saucer, and this right here, what I have right now, is a coffee. I don't know which kind of coffee I never tasted it. So, there you go guys, and I hope you, and I hope you enjoyed the video, and stay tuned for the next peta that I'm gonna use.